Hey guys, so I am home. If you cannot tell, this is the end of the night for me, okay? It is past 11 o'clock and I am tired, all right? I'm tired. I went to Hobby Lobby's, as you guys know. I went to Walmart, as you guys know. I went to Target, <laughs> as you guys know. And I went back to Hobby Lobby's, but the one in Mount Pleasant. And I don't know if I had that conversation with you guys, but that's what I did. Um, that's what we did. So I did take an intermission at a friend's house. And then uh, she came with me to um, go to the Hobby Lobbies in Mount Pleasant. So with that being said, I cannot show you guys everything. I just cannot. Like, I cannot. The stuff is in the garage, and I'm not going down there to get anything out the garage. But with that being said, I bought um, things that you are not going to see. Is I bought a Christmas tree um, for next year um, and prayerfully for the next couple of years. But I bought that, and if they do have some more, um, by Wednesday or Thursday, I will probably purchase one more. Um but anyways, I bought a Christmas tree, seven and a half foot, and then I purchased some things from Hobby Lobby. The one in Mount Pleasant um, had a lot of items from the Grinch, um, and I bought them because my son is always like the Grinch, and that's going to be a lot of our theme for next year. Um just like little things. So he has a tray. A, it's like a green tray that he has that has the Grinch um, like outline of the face or whatever, like the, the features or whatever on it. Whatever. I bought a rug that says Merry Grinch Miss on it. I bought two things that can go on a wall that had to do with the Grinch, um, as well as three different pillows that I purchased from. Um, from there for the Grinch. Now the pillows were five dollars each, um, or probably like four sixty each, but let's say five dollars each. The signs or the pictures, whatever, were I think one was five, and one was four three something. I don't know. Everything was ninety percent off when it came to Hobby Lobbies that I purchased, and. I feel like I'm missing something else that's Grinch related, but it is what it is. I bought a few things that had to do with the Grinch. That's for my baby. That's already um, put in the garage. The pillows were put in a bag before we put it in the garage so that it can um, stay clean because they are white pillows, but they have the Grinch theme on it. I went back and I got more jars <laughs> like these. Um, yeah, more jars like these. I think I got... I don't know how many I purchased originally, but three, I got three more red ones, three more blue ones, one more teal. I don't know. I don't know, but I have to have at least 10 of these, at least 10 of these. Now y'all know I got the red one, the blue one, and then the teal one. They have white ones as well. So I bought some white ones. I think I bought three more white, um, three of them that are white, if I have it correctly. And I just bought some more, okay? I bought some from each store. From each store, all right? Each Hobby Lobby's, because I've been to two. So I got those. Um, I got the gnome ones. I don't know if I showed you guys, because I feel like I talked about and I mentioned it, but I don't know if I showed you guys. So, oh, then I bought me some bowls. I wish I got some of the plates that went with it, but I did not. But this is the bowls. I believe I purchased four. I believe I purchased four. But I like these because even though it's um, Christmas, it gives more of a winter vibe. And there's nothing on here that says Merry Christmas or anything like that. And I really just love the way that it looks. Outdoorsy, snowy. I'm excited. I purchased, um, I think I got four of these if I said it correctly. And they were $1.20 each. 
and I couldn't beat that. They wanted eleven ninety nine for it. This is a Robert Stanley Home Collection Christmas Tableware. Y'all know I wasn't paying twelve dollars. Okay, we, we, we wasn't paying twelve dollars. That we weren't doing. So. I got four of those. And then, that's more of, that's more of the, the, the bubblegum one. Um, I bought some more mugs also, but this one, uh, these are Pokemon ones. This cost a dollar thirty. And it's not bad for a mug, okay? Because I pay for a mug more. I, I, I pay more money than that when I'm buying them from um, TD Maxx and Marshall. Now, I don't get mugs all the time, but if it's something that I want, it's something that I like to save up, I will get it. Um, that's TD Maxx and Marshall. So, I think I got two. Yeah, I got two. Two of those, because I didn't get that the last time. I got the bigger one that had different characters or whatever on it. I was going to order some more of those, or I was going to pick up some more of um, that one. But, why? Maybe the seven. So, he already got one that was a really big... So he can get a little one like that. Unless he wants to give them away. And then. There's so many bags. Listen, I keep hammering that and I'm like, please let it be the bills. Please let it be the bills. Oh, also what I didn't show you. I bought a tree skirt um and that tree skirt matches four of the stockings that i got um and they're like fluffy stockings they have like two balls at the end of them so the skirt has that as well but i did buy eight all together as far as the stockings the other stockings is fluffy as well but it's of oh my god i can't even think of how to like to describe it but it's like a mixed color one but it, it's more so of an off-white and like a tan color together but it's fluffy that one doesn't have balls on it um, but the ones with the balls and the skirt tree that matches they're great so yeah and I bought some um, burgundy like burgundy wine um, color balls um, for the Christmas tree I purchased those as well so I should be okay Christmas tree wise but I'm pretty sure I'll buy some things later on um, or when Christmas comes again just things haphazardly to, to, to put with it um, also I bought some Christmas lights the, the tree and the lights came from Walmart um, the tree was $30 and the lights were 88 cents a piece I think I think they were 88 cents a box and they're for a hundred lights and they're multicolor ones. Now the white lights were a dollar and some change, so I purchased the the, the multicolor one. That's my Target receipt in a Hobby Lobby bag. Um. Oh. Okay. So. Cause I got a lot. All right. This is going to be a long video, but. I bought a few of these. This is all supposed to be a cookie jar. What type of cookies that you put in there? It gotta be quarter, quarter, quarter cookies because the 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 top of it ain't that large, you know, ain't that large at all. But I thought these were adorable too, you know. And I can actually see these for Valentine's Day as well. Don't judge. But the bottom of it looks like the bottom of a heart. Whatever. Whatever. I purchased a few of these. As well. How many? I don't know. But a few. So. Bing in. I. Got. 
don't even know how these are going to work together as far as the things that I purchased. But these four are white. And these are placemats on the table. And I like the knit of it. I thought it was really adorable. Um, I don't know how I'm going to mix and match it, like I said. But I purchased these for $1.20 each as well because they're $11.99 a piece. This is also the Robert Stanley Home Collection. Now, I know I saw something. Something that had Robert Stanley on it not too long ago because I know I just saw it, but I don't know what it was. But yeah, I purchased these. So we're going to put these back in the bag because I think most of these are going to just stay in my closet. <clears throat> and then I got the Grinch. Now, I believe this is a tablecloth. I don't know. But you know, they wanted... Yes, it's a vinyl tablecloth that they wanted $20.99 for. Um, $20.99 for. Who y'all thought was going to purchase that? I don't know, for $20.99? Maybe somebody did. But it wasn't, it wasn't going to be me. But this finishes off the... Um, Grinch for my baby. He has his actual. He has actually has a, his own table that he does work and activities on. He will be able to have the Grinch on it. Now, I purchased because that ain't all that's sitting here. Um. Okay, so, so maybe it is. Now, my confusion is... I purchased some more cups. I purchased two cups that had to do with Home Alone. I know that for sure, and I need to find those. I don't know if my daddy put something somewhere or touched something. Um, well, I know he touched something. Okay, because he helped me bring the bags in. But... I got, I got some glasses that are Home Alone, and one's for my brother, and one's for my son. Um, my brother loves Home Alone, and my baby is like, he likes Home Alone too. I let him be. But I do want to find those. I do want to find those. I thought it wasn't that bad because I saw the green, but that's going to be green. But I know... I think I think I did. Give me a second. Now, in Charleston area here, they stop with regular plastic bags. Um, but I found out in Mount Pleasant, as far as Hobby Lobbies, you have to pay for bags. Like we up north. I just I just, that's all I can say is I just. Oh, okay, so we're going to try to go through this a little faster because it's, it's too much. And I'm at 13, I'm at 14 minutes right now. So, pajama sets, I believe these were like a dollar twenty-five or two fifty. That's slippers. Wonderlust. I think these are like two fifty. The matching pajamas, bottoms, and the top. I think these are like two fifty to get the matching set together. Um, this is a woman's extra large. I feel like it's gonna be big, but I don't even care. I don't even care. So we're taking that one, and then oh, these are the white ones. These are the white ones. We had to take the stuff off the Target bag to put those glasses in this, um, to put the glasses in it because, once again, Hobby Lobby's on Mount Pleasant. You got to bring your own bags or you have to purchase them. Now, the mesh bags are 50 cents, and I guess the paper bags are like, what do you say, 5 cents? Or 10 cents or something like that? He got, he, he, he did, he did get 50 cents 
out of us. But that was it. That was it. That was it. That was it. Too expensive down there for y'all to keep playing with me. Anyways, I purchased this size 8. And I'm not sure how much this was. We're not going to sit here and lie. I don't know how much this was. Hold on. Because evidently we got a lot of Wonderless stuff. Funky, Funko, Funko, Funk. Oh. And I need to go and give that to my friend because she got me tore up. How much this one is? Hmm. I don't know. Between two dollars and a dollar, I don't. I don't know. I don't know. Then I purchased this here. This was a dollar forty, I think. Health and beauty. Make it revolution. Yeah, this was a dollar forty. I got uh, Taraji P. Henson uh, here stuff here. I wish I found another one, but this is the only one that was here. This one cost me a dollar ninety nine for this. I wonder how much you were. Um, do you know Disney? I could take you two out. That's pajamas. Then another one. I believe this was a dollar. Pajama set. I think this is this two X women. I got slippers for my left bug. He should be able to wear this. Or grow into a one. I'm not sure which one. No, he should be able to wear this. This is um, a small, which is 13 one. He wanted some slippers. He needed some slippers actually as well. These cost a dollar twenty five each, and they may be too small for my baby feet. I hope not. I hope not. But this one also was a dollar twenty five, and then got this set here. So, I thought we were getting these sets for my friend, but her ugly self left them with me. She's not ugly. She's actually beautiful, but a heifer left it with me, okay? Now, my baby can wear these now, and he can wait to wear these next year, but the slippers got to be worn now, because we ain't about to try to figure out if he's going to grow out of them. So, that is, that is, that is that stuff there. Um... Also, they're still in Target. We got these. These came from um, Robert Stanley Collection. Again, this is these cost me forty nine cents each. They're fifty cents a piece. I got them. They're not staying for Christmas. We're gonna use these now. We're gonna use these now. At least two of them are gonna use now because I did purchase four of them. So we got that. I got snacks. I think this was this was change. This was change. Okay. I believe this came from Walmart. Um, these here. I think this was a dollar or something like that. I don't know. But maybe we're gonna try these cookies. Okay. I purchased actually no. I don't know. I don't know. I purchased these. They were 49 cents a piece. Each pack. I couldn't leave these. Um, I know I have a boy, but whatever. I purchased this, 49 cents. That's going to go to the side because that's my friend one. And then we purchased two of these. But for some reason, I have both of them. So she's getting that back as well. I mean, I bought a lot of these. And that, listen, we're going to have to go to a part two, okay? We're we, we, we going to have to go to a part two. Or, 
This could be part two. It's still long. It's still long. So I may, I may go ahead and um, stop here and then do part three because, yeah, this is ridiculous. And we're at 20 something minutes. So if you're interested in seeing the rest of what we purchased, stay tuned for the next video. It'll be here, it'll be here in a couple of days. Okay. I love you guys and I do appreciate you guys so, so, so much. I just don't want to sit here and have y'all on this thing for five hours, okay? So, yeah. Until the next video, be beautifully different. Stay beautifully different and be you. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.